Hey guys, it's Jared. This is my first official video for the channel. Right now I'm just gonna go through what all we've done to the cars so far, and then some of the plans that we have coming up in the near future for the cars. So for the 2017, all we've done engine-wise so far is we've got the K&N cold air intake. Uh, I've had that installed for probably a month now. That's the only thing engine-wise that I've done to the car. Um, and then the more noticeable thing on the car is I've got the American Authority Zeal 1-1 LE front bumper on there. And I also put the Z01 badging on it. I know it's not a Z01, but besides the power torque and the actual engine, everything I've got is close to the Z01 at least. So, so on top of that, I've painted my mirrors. I'm gonna be getting the carbon fiber mirror covers for those right now. I've just got the stock rims that are painted. But here in the next two weeks or so, I am actually getting a pair of the 20 inch uh, forged rims that are gonna be going on this. I've got side and rear louvers on it. This spoiler, it's the Z01 1LE replica. Uh, this is actually my second spoiler on this. I've got my bow ties blacked out, all my tail lights tinted third brake like tennis um of course we got the zl1 badging back here i do i don't know how good you can see it but i've got uh no cats all the way back i've got a cherry bomb glass pack on it which actually muffled my car more than anything it didn't help at all um coming in right now i've got a hood that's coming in soon i've got the 20 inch rims that I've got to go get from Kentucky here in the next week or so. Um, I've got a Catless downpipe that is on back order right now. It's about a month behind. So I'll be getting that soon. As soon as I get that in, I'll have that installed within like two days. This is the 2019 LT. Engine is completely stock, not done anything to this yet. This is more of our weekend just drive around car, but it will have some stuff done to it. I definitely like the sound of the cold air intake, so it will be getting that. Uh, on this one, we just got black emblems, the black wheels on it. Oh, on both cars, we do have the uh, tinted side markers too. I like the way that the black looks compared to the amber and red. This one has the low level spoiler, but eventually it will have the uh, 1LE. Um, we also tinted these tail lights. These ones were done very bad though. I mean, so we're gonna be getting the actual factory tinted tail lights for it. Uh, obviously the MMs are blacked out and the third brake light still has to be done on this one. Um, that's about it for those two cars. A motorcycle, which is a CVR 600RR, it's an 09. Um, it's basically stock, I believe. I bought it like this, I haven't done anything to it yet. It's got nice handle grips compared to, compared to my other bike. I had a FC6R Yamaha and it was more of a touring bike that had adjusted and everything. So this bike's a lot more fun for me. Um, we've got the Handlebars were the biggest thing I noticed different compared to the FC6R. I've got the the clutch is definitely a lot touchier, quicker on like I gets to the gears a lot quicker. That's for sure. And then this one's got I didn't do this exhaust, so I'm not sure what it is, but it sounds really good. It's really loud. Uh, yeah, that's about. It, other than those cars, we do have a Ram 1500 right there. It's nothing special, it's just a Thunder Road edition. It sounds really good, it's the V8 Hemi. Uh, it sounds good, but I wanna get some new wheels and rims for it. It's nothing special yet though. Uh, in here, this is 
I'm just now starting to work on setting it up as an actual garage. So far it's just been a storage room and now I'm trying to set it up as a legit place and I'm turn on the lights for you. It's got pretty good lighting in here. Uh, I actually just did this today. This is the old bumper on the 17 LT. I think it looks pretty sweet just up there on the wall. It looks mean. Uh, got our stock exhaust. I've got both my helmets. This is kind of, I got some of my tools right there that I haven't opened. This is my girlfriend's art stuff. We've got the rest of my tools and just stuff. And then on the other half of the garage, this is kind of our outdoor living area. And I've got some shoes up on the wall. All of our pops are up there. And it's more of a lounge around side of the garage. But yeah, so far on the 2017, the silver one, we went to definitely the hood, the wheels, carbon fiber mirror covers. Basically, all the carbon fiber inserts for the interior are going to be done. Uh, I do have to redo the interior because I've had some messes in there. Um, spoilers basically fine. I am going to get the um, dive planes installed eventually. I can't, I haven't completely figured those out. Uh, long term, I am going to be engine swapping these. I'm not completely sure what I'm going to put in there. But there will be a new engine put in this one. The 19 on the other hand. It's only. We might do a. Uh, the 2019 or 2020. Front bumper. The SS. On this one. Because we like the way it looks. We like the angles it takes down at the. Fog lights. The daytime running lights. Uh, it probably will end up. It's definitely going to end up with some new wheels. A new hood or a must. Um. The spoiler is probably going to get the same one I have. We don't know about louvers yet. Our son likes the louvers because it's really shady. But he also likes to look out the car, which is right. He really likes our truck. And then my uh, motorcycle, really all I'm going to do to it is probably just some like wheel lighting. Just some more like exterior lighting going to shows and stuff like that. I'm not going to really do anything crazy to it because I love the way it sounds. All that. Um... And in here in the garage, we are going to eventually have some kind of like mural up there. Get some more decorations in here. And um, just basically decorate a little bit and complete the garage. Um, that's about it for this video. I know it's not much. Uh, the more I get into this, the better I get at editing because I'm not great at editing. The more there's going to be. And I'd like to get some fun content and more parts in here to actually install onto the cars and if uh you don't care go ahead and hit that subscribe button the like button and let's do this journey together have some fun with it too thanks for watching